Years ago, the Midlands experienced record levels of rain, causing what's known as the thousand year flood. Dams broke, roads closed, and communities suffered serious damage. But one of those affected communities is getting some good news today. Our Jalen Tart has more on the improvements coming to Belvedere. Residents here in the Belverdine community are seeing major home improvements just like this one where they are seeing HVAC systems, roofing systems, and other maintenance repairs being done. The Belvedere community suffered major damage in 2015 following severe flooding. How are you? Thank y'all so much. Angela Richardson seeing the improvements to her mother's house for the first time. Following the floods, this house was left with severe mold and other damage. In here, you could actually like smell like the dampness in the house and stuff like that. So it was a lot of mold and everything everywhere. The Belvedere community is made up of African American seniors living on fixed incomes. State Representative Leon Howard, along with City Councilman Ed McDowell, said the disaster relief project to repair these homes is in phase two with 20 homes already completed. African Americans communities did not get what they deserve in the, in the DR program. We have a tremendous amount of problems with the DR program as we speak. We have other people in other communities who are receiving poor service. The repairs to Belvedere cost $4 million with the money coming. Howard challenged the city of Columbia and Richland County to have more resources for communities that are in need. So I am asking the city of Columbia as well as Richland County when the lobbyists start talking to us that they, they, talk to, they talk about resources for communities like this, communities like Greenview and other communities so that we can work together and find resources to help these people who, who deserve it. And um, so that is, my, that is my pledge going back in, in, in January. For Richardson and her mother, they are forever thankful for the work to help bring joy and happiness back to the community. It's just one of those things, it just takes the load off of our minds completely. And I know for me, I'll be able to rest a whole lot better. Richardson and her family commend Representative Howard for all the work he's done for the Belvedere community. Reporting in Richland County, Jalen Hart, WIS News 10. And Howard's goal is to have the Belvedere project completed by the end of the year.